let us study how to calculate median by using the formula as well as obtaining the median graphically now the formula for median is as follows median is equal to l plus n upon 2 minus cf divided by f into h here l is the lower limit n is the total of frequency cf is cumulative frequency f is frequency and h is class width we will see how to calculate this using the formula for that let's say this is the question given where you have class and frequency what you need to do is calculate cumulative frequency and it should be the less than type so first we will prepare a table with class and frequency that is given class frequency and less than cumulative frequency the classes given are 1400 to 1600 1600 to 1800 1800 to 2000 2000 to 2200 2200 to 2400 and 2400 to 2600 the frequencies were 12, 30, 55, 40, 35 and 28. Now according to the formula we need N which is the total of frequency. So let's take the total of the frequency column. And that is 200 now to prepare less than cumulative frequency we write the first frequency as it is that is 12 and then to 12 we keep adding the next frequency that is 30 so that makes it 42 then to 42 you add the next 55 and get 97 and so on 137 plus 35 is 172 plus 28 that is 200 so finally the total of the frequency and the last of the cumulative frequency should be the same that is 200 okay now what we need to do is in your formula there is an element called n by 2 if you see the first thing in the bracket is n by 2 let us see what is n by 2 here n divided by 2 will be the total of frequency n is 200 so 200 
divide by 2 which is equal to 100. Now 100 has to be spotted in the less than cumulative frequency column. So 100 is not in this class, is not in this class, it's not even in this class but yes 100 will be included here because for the first time cumulative frequency has exceeded 100. So this whole class is known as the median class. This class is called the median class. Now we can use our elements from the formula where the first one L is the lower limit. So for the median class 2000 is the lower limit. Then N we have CF cumulative frequency is the one above the median class. So cumulative frequency not of the median class but of the one above the median class. So 97 will be our cumulative frequency. Then we need F frequency that will be of the median class that is 40. And class width is the difference between the upper limit and lower limit. So H will be equal to 2200 minus 2000 which is equal to 200. It has come from the difference between the upper class and the lower class. Now we have all the elements of the formula so we can apply the formula and the formula was median is equal to L plus N upon 2 minus CF divided by F into H that is equal to L the lower limit of the median class 2000 plus N by 2 already calculated here that is 100 minus CF was the cumulative frequency above the median class that is 97 divided by F of the median class was 40 into H that we just calculated was 200. So that is equal to 2000 plus 3 upon 40 into 200 and solving that the final answer is 2015 that is our median by the formula method. Now let us see how to plot the median or how to obtain the median using the graphical method. What we need to do is draw an x and y axis
on the y axis we will have the less than cumulative frequency and on the x axis we have the class so first we will mark our classes according to the formula our classes were 1400 1600 1800 2000 2200 2400 2600 and our less than cumulative frequency that we had calculated less than cumulative frequency we have to plot all these on the y axis that is 12 42 97 so coming back to our graph uh, we will take a difference of 20 on the y axis so 20 40, 60, 80, 100, 120, 140, 160, 180 and 200. Now what we need to do is for the respective class we need to plot the less than cumulative frequency so our, for a first class that is 1400 to 1600 the less than cumulative frequency is 12 so going back to the graph and 12 is somewhere here on the y-axis and it will be plotted on the upper limit of that class so if I have to plot it it will be somewhere here the next cumulative frequency was 42 which will be plotted on 1800 so 42 is somewhere here so going right up to 1800 is our point the next one is 97 which will be somewhere just below 100 that will be plotted on 2000 the next 137 which will be a little below 140 will be plotted on 2200 next one 172 which is somewhere here and that will be plotted on 2400 and finally 200 which will be plotted on 2600 
now what we do is draw a curve through all of these points that we just plotted and that will be a freehand curve so make sure you pass through all those points okay now what we need is n by 2 which we have already calculated was 200 divided by 2 equal to 100 now 100 has to be plotted on the y-axis which is at this point already we have 100 here and now what you have to do is from 100 you draw a straight line right up to the curve so taking 100 as the starting point you draw a straight line to the curve and once it touches the curve from there we draw a straight line to the x-axis so going down to the x-axis now the point at which it meets the x-axis is the median obtained graphically and if you see it is a little ahead of 2000 which roughly can be said as 2015 that we had already got by calculating using the formula 2015 so just to summarize now to obtain median graphically what you do, do is draw a x and y axis plot the class on the x axis less than cumulative frequency on the y axis from the table that you prepared using the data from the question we will plot the points on the x and y axis then what you need to do is draw a less than cumulative frequency curve the curve that you drew was of less than cumulative frequency then n by 2 has to be plotted on the y-axis that we had plotted here and from there you draw a straight line towards the curve and the point at where it meets the curve from there you go downwards to the x-axis and finally the point at which it meets the x-axis is the median.